If we look at all the evidence now, it becomes more and more evident that mind and consciousness and spirit are not simply byproducts of brain activity. And in my view, and also in the view of uh, my colleagues, this realization will eventually lead us to the greatest scientific revolution that we've ever had in the history of humanity. Expanding reality. Expanding reality. Visionary scientists in physics, cosmology, biology, neuroscience, medicine, psychology, and psi research are founding the Academy for the Advancement of Post-Materialist Sciences. Materialism, which has served us very well and done wonderful things, has simply gotten to a point where it does not address uh, all of the research data, just on the basis of evidence. It's very hard to get people to change their point of view. It seems as though the direction that science is moving is going towards, towards consciousness as some kind of substrate, a ground state from which things arise. And our bodies and even our minds are aspects of those things that are arising. Today, as all days, every single person who comes into our path is a messenger, a sacred messenger. How do you define mind? Consciousness and spirituality. Can a single person influence collective consciousness? What is the relationship between consciousness? And so what I want people to realize is how sacred life is. Expanding reality. Expanding reality. Expanding reality.